All right. My buddy Ray, quickly, before we uh, bring up Doug Benson. Thank you. Uh, we used to break into the Mulholland Club, as you all did as a youth, I'm sure. Well, you, well, you got to set it all the way up. I don't think people really understand what that is. The Mulholland Club's a highfalutin, sort of a Jewish well, club. I don't know if they, I don't know how that works, but it's, you know, it's in the, up, up by uh, Hebrew Heights, as they used to call it. Up there in Laurelwood. Just, just make note. Adam's racism is something that's been long standing. It's well, all good. it's all good. It was. It it's was. Called, good. I didn't name it Hebrew Heights. I got it. Gotcha. It's not it's like good. I planted a flag in the name of Spain. That's that's. It was called Hebrew Heights. But, I didn't make the shit up. I wish kid. I did. You were the poor kid down in the flatlands. I lived down in the flatlands. Yeah. But poor kid. To, and everybody heard these stories. Yeah. We used to go. Yeah, we used okay. to go break okay. into the Mulholland Club, and and Ray figured out that if he, you know, and we'd go skinny dipping and whatnot in the middle of the night, and Ray Ray figured out that if if he put his ass up against the jacuzzi jet, he could fill himself up, and he could expel what was in him with great velocity. And and. And uh, joy and accuracy, yes? Uh, it's not, not so much well, accuracy. Well, it's not like his asshole was rifled. I mean, it's not, not that really kind s- of accuracy. No, more, more musket ball than Got it, it would, would be. Got it. More Actually, than like 44 I believe, slug. But, yeah. I believe the way you described it, he's, he'd be in the jacuzzi and he'd walk over you. and. Unload. Well, he, he could do that. Yeah, he would, <laughs> so, he would, he would do that on occasion. So. <laughs> but listen, here's the thing. The third time he did it, nothing came out but pool water. It was no big deal. <laughs> Third time. <laughs> it was just you when know, it would be there. You want to see if you can miss round one. <laughs> that's that's when all the the real heavy lifting so was what do you, done. Like you put know? his legs up on the on the side of the pool and put he, his. Yeah, Ugh. it's insane. I, I listen. I didn't. You know, I didn't invent jacuzzi or come up assholes, with that? It's it like licking toads or something. Well, who, who thought who of that? Who was the first guy decided to eat lobster? That's what How I'm the saying. fuck do I know? The point is, is we do it, and that's what makes us different than the apes. You understand? Right. Oh, very. It's called uh, progress, dude. Don't yeah, get in the yeah. way. It's uh, pushing the frontiers, yes. So he, yes, he's a pioneer. Pioneer, he is. He I, think Ray, I think pioneer. He's goddamn hero is what he is. So he would Great put American. His, put his ass against the thing, and then he would you know, shoot this rooster tail <laughs> of, of pool water out of his ass. And I, I listen. I'm, I'm Drew. As if, please back me up. That is a very powerful muscle down yeah, there. Yeah, yeah. Sure. Strong, eighteen-year-old well, lad. Oh, you put uh, eighteen gallons in there. Yeah, it's yeah, coming and that back thing hard. Yeah. comes out with a lot well, of, of force, velocity. Yeah. yeah, and so, you know, this was amusing to all of us, and it was fun. But it's like we decided we should take this on the road. You know, I mean, why, why not? Share this gift with other people. You know, why are we limiting it just to the sure. few people that are here? So, you know, I said, Ray, uh, do you think you could do that same thing with the uh, garden hose? You know, and fill he up said, with the garden hose. Yeah, I said, I don't see why not. Huh. So, well, listen, we didn't have uh, your Wii and your satellite television. How about Pong? And your game boxes and your uh, Ultranet and all the shit you guys have. We had to make our own goddamn fun. Simpler times. It was a simpler time. Filling your rectum up with water. <laughs> but well, again, we didn't have we didn't have ATMs filled with money it. and joysticks at home. We had to make our own fun. When people criticize the uh, texting and email and stuff, I'm going to bring this up. Now yeah, gonna, yeah. Next, so next I, I you interview. know, so so one one. Wait, wait now, hold a second. But what did you didn't first garden hose? Your first question was, can you can you do something with this? Right. I mean, weren't you well, first we, conceiving what you were going to do before you figured out where you were going to fill them up? Well, we knew, you know, we knew we had a gift, if that's <laughs> what you're asking. I mean, there I was see, no... I see. Okay. I so knew I had a, a young, raw prospect so here. That, where you know, did you get the garden hose? What? The garden hose? Yeah. Well, it was my mom's house. Ah. Okay. And um, thankfully, she... <laughs> my mom's house... Well, it was her, actually, she was just flopping there. It was my grandmother's second house, but it was a... She had a hose bib right out on the front lawn, like way out. You didn't have to go in the backyard or anything. Perfect. It was just sitting out there in the front lawn and uh, was in North Hollywood. And it was right right down the street from the Jack in the Box. So we figured, uh, you know, let's hit the drive through <laughs> and see how this is going to work. I, uh, you know what, I, you know what, it's, it's, you know, it, it sounded like an awesome idea at the time. I understand it sounds, you know, peculiar now. 
But, you know, this was 1982. It was a different time. People squirting water out of their ass. You know, it was a different... <laughs> to amuse themselves. That was a different you. thing. To, to yeah, yeah. yeah, it's like okay. seeing... You know, one of those pictures of you from the uh, 80s with the funky hair, only if water was coming out of your ass, you know? It, Let's not forget so, that... So you, uh, he filled up... Mm, yeah. He also measured uh, how far it could be thrown. Oh, you actually did a little contest. How far it, 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 it went, we could go over 20. 21.6 was, about, was about the range that uh, Ray oh could my do. God. So, uh, so he filled himself up. He filled himself up with my yeah. mom's uh, garden hose. Nice. And uh, now, now he couldn't drive a stick. You think a guy this talented, <laughs> <laughs> with these kinds of gifts, you know what I mean? Touched powers. by the hand of God. Yeah, these powers. are powers. Yeah. That's right. Mm. Like Zeus or Socrates or something. This guy has like powers, but he couldn't drive a stick. Yeah. So uh, I could. So uh, we drove a uh, t- like Toyota hatchback that uh, we could barely fit into. And the thing, the thing about once you fill up, it's. It, it, you know, it's not a science. I, I'm going to be up front with you. If any of you guys are going to try this when you get home, you are a ticking time bomb. And, 